Katrina, let me ask you, what really makes RoofSnap stand out as a roof measuring tool? Yeah, I'd have to say the uh, availability of premium, high-resolution imagery. Absolutely. Having multiple imagery options is uh, something that we've had in RoofSnap for quite some time. However, one of the downsides has been having to buy before you try. Mm -hmm. Committing to a $5 purchase for Nearmap's high-resolution imagery isn't uh, the most attractive thing to some people. Uh, and so we've come up with a solution for that, which we'd like to show you today. And that is being able to preview small thumbnails of all of your imagery options, even before you commit to a purchase. Yes, it's a great way to select the, the correct view of the roof that you wanna use. Yeah, let's show uh, how this functionality works and why it's so beneficial. Yeah. I'm gonna create a new project. And from this address, let's go ahead and create the project. Within the project, we're gonna jump right into the sketch scene and it's gonna kind of show us the house on the street where it exists. Mm -hmm. Now, this isn't the imagery per se. We're actually just using this map view to confirm the location. Gotcha. Uh, if we needed a house left or right, we could always move the map. We can zoom the map in and out with these plus and minus buttons. Okay. Uh, so let's zoom in at one level because that's, that's really ideal, that zoom level for a residential roof. Mm -hmm. And let's go ahead and confirm the location. Now from here, we're gonna focus in on our premium imagery. Okay. These come from Nearmap and they do have a $5 cost. Mm -hmm. uh, there are some standard imagery options as well, but we really wanna focus on these Nearmap high resolution images because of how much more accurate your measurements are gonna be using a Nearmap image. Definitely. One thing you wanna look for, um, an image with limited shadows. Mm -hmm. Uh, this first one here, we can see quite a bit of shadows from the trees nearby. The next image, some leaf coverage. Now this leaf coverage doesn't actually obscure our view of the house. So the next thing we're going to think about is, is the camera directly over the roof? Gotcha. If you can see any of the walls, mm -hmm. then you know that that camera is kind of coming in from an angle. And that's not going to give you a true top-down view. Gotcha. So of all of these, most, you know, most of these images here within Nearmap are going to be, um, are going to be usable mm -hmm. for this location, but perhaps you don't want to go with the oldest imagery. Um, I know that Nearmap has gotten better uh, with its newer camera systems. I would use this 2018 image from March 2nd if it weren't for those heavy shadows. Sure. Um, the next one here, you know, again, the leaf coverage isn't really impacting. So I think that um, the newest imagery, all other things being equal, is probably the best bet. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the purchase button of that image. Uh, and I believe I could also just click anywhere on the image and it's going to bring up that confirmation screen. Gotcha. Uh, then I can go ahead and click on the purchase button. And that is going to load in the high resolution version of this image right into the screen. Nice. From here, I have the ability to uh, zoom in even further with Near Map. Mm -hmm. So I can plus, press on the plus button again and go to the maximum zoom level here, which is going to make it a lot easier for me to line up this roof. You may have seen this before. We have rotation buttons. We can go quarter turns, left and right, or we can do very small modifications with these rotation buttons here. Do spend a minute, uh, you know, just lining up the roof. And I'm sure we have a couple other videos that you may have already seen on using 90 mode and making sure the roof is nice and square. But in order to show you how high the resolution is, I do want to go ahead and save this image into the project. Great. Now we can go and really zoom in on the image. Now we are over zooming. You can see that it's getting pixelated, but I mean, you can see the skylights. You can see the hat vents. You can see the chimney over here on the right. It's amazing. This high resolution imagery, the only way to get a higher resolution image is to fly a drone mm -hmm. uh, with a high resolution camera. Uh, that being said, uh, we hope that being able to preview these new thumbnail images before you buy uh, will uh, ease your mind uh, with regard to uh, kind of knowing what you get before you commit to that charge.